Do you know what zodiac sign you are? I bet you do. Literally everyone gets asked this question at least one time in their life. I mean, many people even have it in their social media bios. It's a way to try and predict and understand people's personality traits that you may come into contact with. Now, do I think it's always perfectly accurate? No, not necessarily. But I do think it's fun regardless. So let's find out what type of martial arts training styles each zodiac sign has. What's up guys, it's the only ninja wearing aviators and a superhero hat and a welcome to the modern ninja, specifically welcome to part two of the Zodiac Sign series. Let me know down in the comments below what Zodiac Sign you think I am. I'm curious as to what you guys think. But without further ado, let's jump into the next sign. Roll out the red carpet because the Leo has arrived. Leos are typically passionate, loyal, optimistic, confident, and incredibly dramatic. This fire sign is the king or queen of their jungle. They And they love to bask in the spotlight and celebrate themselves. They are awesome teammates who bring lots of fun and laughter to the training session. Honestly, they're probably everyone's favorite person at the gym. And when it comes to their own personality training, they are 100% dedicated to their training. Basically, the entire world revolves around their training, and that's just the way they like it. Some famous Leo fighters include Nick Diaz, BJJ champion Bruno Pussy, and UFC flyweight champion Demetrius Johnson. Have you ever heard of the expression, if you want something done, give it to a busy person? <laughs> well, that is 200% a Virgo anthem. They are very logical, practical, and systematic in their approach to life. This earth sign has a deep-rooted presence in the material world and is a perfectionist through and through. They are always looking to improve their skills through practice. Because they are used to being in control of their lives, they take that to the cage and the mats and the rings and wherever else they may be training. They work extra hard to take control of their environment and aim to be as well prepared for their next fight as humanly possible. They're gonna be the ones spending hours watching tapes and doing whatever it takes to be ready for that next fight. Some examples of Leo fighters include the BJJ champion Teko Shinzato, Leonardo Issa, and Mirko Filipovic. A Libra is defined by balance, harmony, and justice, which, you know, makes sense when their air sign is represented by scales. They have a strong fixation on establishing equilibrium in all areas of their life, especially when it comes to emotional matters. And in fact, of all zodiac signs, you won't find more world champions and MMA superstars than Libras. Martial arts is literally the perfect thing to help these balance seekers find their center and their happy place. This gives them the calm they need in their otherwise chaotic life. And when they're there, they're great at motivating those around them and coming up with great game plans for the fight. Just a few of the amazing Libra fighters include the legendary Helio Gracie, the great Evander Holyfield, and the UFC middleweight world champion, Rich Franklin. Scorpios are one of the most misunderstood signs of the Zodiac. This water sign is self-reliant, strong-willed, intense, and uses emotional energy as fuel. They cultivate powerful wisdom through both the physical and emotional zone. Scorpio actually derives its amazing courage from its physical abilities and skills, making the sign very complicated and dynamic. And in a match, that intense and daring energy comes out easily. For them, there's no going light or taking it easy. It is all in or nothing at all. And as crazy as that might sound, this is usually an advantage. Always training at your max and making sure nobody is ever gonna mess with you. Some famous Scorpios include Larry Holmes, the legend Rickson Gracie, and the lightweight world champion Rafael Dos Anjos. So tell me, did I cover your sign in this video? If I did, drop a like. And if I didn't, comment below and tell me which sign you are. And of course, subscribe and maybe even hit that bell so you don't miss when I post the next part Part of this series. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore, this is The Modern Ninja, and I'm out. If you like this video, make sure to check out, well, part one of the series, or this other video that you think you will enjoy as well. Either way, I'll see you guys in the next one.